Hello everyone, today we have new video review and as you can see this time it will be a new release from MiniArt, of course it is modded in 135 scale and this time it might be handy with their civil releases, as you can see we have Auto Travelers from 1930s, 1940s, there are four figures as far as you can understand from the box art and it might be really useful addition for the Arama scene, maybe just to uh, enhance appearance of your car in 135 scale. So this is a commercial sample, it means you will get exactly the same stuff as what you will see in this video review and box size here is quite typical, here you can see comparison with my hand, box art looks nice. Here on the side we have some information about this kit and then on the opposite side we have some other kits uh, from MiniArt, we reviewed some of them so you can find review on our YouTube channel and here on the rear side you can notice the assembly manual which is combined together with painting guide and of course paints chart here in several manufacturer designations in case you use different uh, paint brands. So this is a side opening box and here is what we have inside. Do not put anything heavy on the top because otherwise you might end up with smashed box. But here we have everything sealed into one plastic bag so we are going to open it and take a closer look at parts. So sealed plastic bag is typical for mini art. There is nothing special in this or unusual I would say. So be ready to tear it apart. I usually use scissors as you can see. So first of all we are going to start with the sprue which is dedicated to luggage and as you remember this luggage was also re included in the recent car release so here we have it and it might be familiar to some of you who already uh, saw previous video review and those ones are really nice accessories for your figures here you can see them from the opposite side they should be easy to assemble so nothing to worry about and of course it will add some fine touch to overall appearance because just figures are also boring so here we have some luggage to place in their hands so just beside them okay and next we have four figures on four frames so there is no use to look just like this we are going to zoom into one of them and take a closer look so here you can see that this is a typical 135 scale parts division we have separate legs, hands and various uh, closest accessories we will see this uh, frame from the opposite side just in a second when we will check other figures here you can see guy which is standing so it's a quite a simple pose yes there might be a small amount of flesh around some parts but it is easy to clean them so no worries I think it won't be such a difficult task and here you can see some torsos and hands for uh, other figures now we can flip it over here you can notice that we have these large plastic pins and maybe you can understand why I'm saying large, here you can see them from the side. So they're quite long and you have to delete them of course, but I think that's not such a difficult task. And there are no guiding pins inside, so be ready to um, attach all this stuff with your own hands and adjust the position. And this might be a bit tricky for beginners because poses are predefined so you have to achieve somehow natural appearance but I think professionals will do it really fast. So as I said this set should be already available on Modelimax webshop. Of course if you like this video and you want to help us press the like button here and subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will see you in the next video review as usual. Thank you for joining me today and bye!